time no see. I haven't filmed a video in a month. I'm sorry. You probably didn't even notice I was gone, but you know. You should apologize where you should apologize, I guess. I don't know. But today I thought I was going to do a currently favorites video because I haven't done one since September, which I uploaded in October. So now I'm doing a currently favorites in the beginning of December and uh, hoping that it will be up before December ends. So I thought that I was just going to scrap my old method of doing currently favorites because I feel like it just took a long time to categorize everything and I'm just gonna talk about the things that I liked and just kind of randomly pick them and I'll have order. Order? That was a hard word to say. First up we have the fact that I have cut my hair. You probably didn't notice because of the fact that I only cut off about uh, five centimeters so it's not that much but it just felt good to cut off the really really bad parts of my hair so I just basically said that you know cut off as much as you need and the five centimeters was as much as you got cut off I guess. Me and my dad went to Germany in the end of November and I had a great time even though it was constantly raining. So basically what we did we just went from pub to pub and just drank beer and just ate great foods and it was just I had a great time. I just like going to Germany. I think it's very nice and the fact that you just you're basically away for just one day and it's just a quick trip to do and I like it so then I have Star Wars. I got two posters when I was in Germany and I love them. I put them up right above my couch so I can see them constantly except for when I'm sitting in the couch, I guess. But I really really like them and I got them for free so I'm like, yes! I like it so much. They're pretty. And then I also have two Star Wars shirts that I got when I was in Germany and the first one is this one! But I got it at New Yorker, I think, uh, if I remember correctly, and I really like it. And we have, you know, C-3PO and not 2 d 2 and it's just Star Wars, and I love it so much! It's so pretty! And it's this kind of cream color, so it's not white. I have another one that I'm gonna show you in a second that's, that's like, white, white. This is not white! This is cream beige color! I don't know. What am I even talking about? I don't know. Next shirt! I got this white men's shirt. Yes, it is for the males, but I got it anyways. And it's just the new Stormtroopers and Star Wars. And this is probably the one that I'm going to wear at the premiere. I'm not gonna, I'm not going to the premiere because the tickets have sold out. But I am probably gonna wear this when I actually go and see the movie because I don't know, it just feels right. It just feels right to wear it because it actually is like, the new Star Wars, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to wear one of them. But I really like it. And I am a little bit hyperactive. I have had too much coffee, so I'm sorry. And then I also have a shirt that I wore in my last video that I filmed, which was A Few Good Songs. And it's this beautiful... Uh, sweater. Where is it? There you are. I have hair all over it. That's pretty. But I love it. It's a yellow mustard sweater. And it's just very, very pretty, so, yeah. What am I even doing? I'm so sorry. I also have this one to talk about, and it's Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, and it's the latest Mission Impossible movie that came out, and I really enjoyed it. I didn't think I would, because I'm more of a Bond girl. That sounded wrong, because I'm nowhere close to be a Bond girl, but I like Bond more than I like the Mission Impossible movies. Not saying that I haven't enjoyed them, because I have, but I think that the last one, Ghost Protocol, and this one is just... Mm. It's so fun about the fact that we have a Swedish actress in it, and the fact that they spoke Swedish. I was like, SWEDISH! The way you should react when people speak your native language in movies, apparently. Next up, we have nail polish, and I'm not actually wearing any nail polish, which is, you know, ironic. But this is the Nude Nerd color from H&M. I've had this for forever, and I started wearing this in the beginning of November and I wore it for mostly the whole of November and I really really liked it and it's just really nice if you don't want to wear any color but you still want to wear nail polish if that makes any sense I just think it's pretty and lastly we have a book because books are important and you should read and that is Daughter of Smoking Bone by Lainey Taylor and I got this as a recommendation from a friend I've owned this book for I don't know how long I think since my last birthday, so about a year and a half, and she read it in Swedish and she was like, oh, it's so good, you should read it! And I was like, okay, 
I read it, and I read it, and I love it, and now I want the second one, but I don't have the second one, but I really want it, because this was so good, this would definitely be in, like, one of my favorite books of all time, so I really recommend you to read this, because it's so, 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 so good. Except for that, I have nothing more to talk about. I guess he did decorate our tree. Well, my mom decorated her tree. Well, I helped my mom decorate her tree. What am I trying to say? Yeah, it's white. Don't judge. It's pretty. It's really, really pretty. Anyways, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Be kind to one another and yourself. And I will see you in my next video. May the force be with you. Bye.